hi there. We are going to continue reviewing characters. All right, I know we went over yesterday and we talked about um, the character Little Red, but today we're gonna to talk about um, characters from yesterday's drama. So let's go ahead and review our anchor chart and then we'll start talking about those characters. Characters, who, what, why? Who, characters are the people, animals, or things a story is about. Look for clues in the words and pictures to get to know them, okay? What? Describe what characters look like and what they think, feel, say, and do. Why? Tell why they do what they do, right? Okay, let's get into it. Yesterday we read the, um, the veggie thief. That's what we read. And today I would like to talk about two of the characters from yesterday's drama. Let's see. There we go. Rabbit and skunk. Those were yesterday's characters. So right now we're going to focus on the who. So who? Rabbit and skunk. I would like for you to think, are they people, animals, or things? They're animals, right? Now, are they talking animals? Yes, they are. So does that make yesterday's um, story, yesterday's drama, is it um, fiction or nonfiction? It's fiction. It's fake. We're not going to have... Um, a story. I'm sorry, we're not, animals do not really talk in real life like these characters do, do they? No. So this story was made believe, made up. Okay, let's um, now talk about what. Describe what the characters look like and what they think, feel, say, and do. So let's focus on Rabbit real quick. Let's talk about what Rabbit looks like. It's kind of hard to see and I can kind of help, I can help you with this. Rabbit is actually, um, it's a um, kind of a tan. He's kind of tan, right? Um, now is rat. Let's talk about Rabbit's character from yesterday. Rabbit was um, always just trying to be nice and helpful to Skunk, right? Always offering him new tr uh, different treats that he just got done making, right? Okay. Let's talk about Skunk. Skunk is. You know, like a typical skunk has um, the fur is black and white. Skunk keeps getting upset because the vegetables keep disappearing from the garden. The ones that he keeps making, right? Yeah. So we talked about what they look like. And skunk keeps having kind of a rough day with all his vegetables getting stolen. And rabbit's always there to cheer skunk up. So that's what they look like and kind of um, what they do, right? really good friend that keeps baking treats and offering them to skunk trying to cheer skunk up and skunk um, keeps getting upset because the vegetables keep disappearing so that's what their characters are doing now why does rabbit do why does rabbit behave the way rabbit does right because rabbit is just trying to be a good friend and cheer skunk up now we do find out at the end of the play that rabbit is the one responsible for taking all the vegetables, but Rabbit thought, you know, hey, it's community garden. I, you know, anyone can grab the vegetables. And it's just a really big misunderstanding, but so Rabbit's trying to be a good friend, right? And try to make treats and um, good, yummy, warm food and offer them to her friends. Skunk keeps getting upset, why? The vegetables that Skunk is planting keep disappearing, right? So Skunk is just acting um, the way he does because he's upset that his vegetables keep disappearing. So that's just a little bit about these two characters. We learned about them yesterday. We, you know, I acted them out. Now today is just to kind of look at both the characters and talk about who they are, what they do, and why they do what they do. So I hope you liked today's little review of our characters, and um, I hope you liked reviewing these two characters from yesterday's drama. All right.